Hello and welcome to this Black Talk Radio News Brief. My name is Scotty Reed, just reminding you to please support independent black media, support independent black platforms, and you can do that by making a donation to the nonprofit Black Talk Media Project by going to blacktalkradionetwork.com. So today I, I saw um, this meme go viral about Walmart capitalizing off of Juneteenth by creating a product of ice cream <laughs> with the red, black, and green colors and, and what have you. Um, the Walmart brand is great value. So doing what capitalists do, um, Walmart has come out with this Juneteenth ice cream. But because of social media outrage, they will no longer be uh, offering that product. As you can see here, Walmart to remove its Juneteenth ice cream after facing backlash on social media. But it's one thing that I noticed as an abolitionist, a modern day abolitionist. You know, I used to co host and produce new abolitionist radio, which started in 2012 to point to, out to people that, yeah, we celebrating Juneteenth, but slavery was never abolished. The 13th Amendment says, Slavery and involuntary servitude shall be abolished except as a punishment for crime. And a lot of people don't know that, still don't know that. Even after documentaries and books have been written about it, again, you know, we, we did that podcast for a number of years, New Abolitionist Radio, which you can still check out some of the uh, podcasts in our archives on blacktalkradionetwork.com. But this is what enrages me take a look at this where was all the backlash on social media or in the real world about walmart and not just walmart but all these other companies that use prison slave labor i mean i just did a, a social not a social media search but a search engine search on walmart in prison labor and this has been written on as far back as 2014 and as late as 2021. And I'm sure there's other articles that have been uh, written more recently pointing out these U.S. corporations that use prison slave labor. But where is the mass outrage? Where is the backlash towards that to get them to stop using prison labor? Now, I'm not saying that Prisoners shouldn't work, and I'm not saying that these corporations shouldn't utilize prison labor. But if they're going to use prison labor, they need to be paying them whatever the, the labor market rate is for the jobs that these people are doing. But no, what they get paid is slave wages. And, and I know that term has been used before, but... Um, it's really just sickening that so many people don't seem to care and there's no mass movement uh, really to get these corporations to stop practicing slavery. But we'll be practicing, we'll be celebrating Juneteenth and even going to Walmart to buy, you know, products for our Juneteenth celebration. Maybe not the ice cream, but other products. So I just wanted to point that out. Um, given that this is a big social media story about the Juneteenth ice cream. All right, that's all I got to say on the matter. Keeping it brief, this has been Scotty Reed with another Black Talk Radio News Brief. Again, please support independent black media and black platforms. Make a donation to the Black Talk Media Project. Peace and blessings.